He has been known by many for courting controversy. Only recently, the vocal Mombasa County Governor Hassan Ali Joho was barred from attending the relaunch of Mtongwe Crossing Channel, which was presided over by President Uhuru Kenyatta. His decree is one that has previously been vehemently questioned by his critics until Kampala University came out in the open to confirm that indeed he was a student at the institution. The latest controversy is in relation to whether he indeed sat for his KCC examination in 1992. Mombasa County Director of Communication Richard Chacha was quoted saying contrary to claims that Joho sat his KCC examination in 1992. The true position is he sat his examination in 1993, daring his critics to visit Sereni Secondary School where he called to verify the same. But amidst this litany of controversies, a survey by opinion pollster InfoTrack, Harris indicates Joho would easily retain his seat if elections were held today. According to the survey, 62% of the locals say they will still vote for Joho, while only 8% say they will vote for Jubilee Party's Suleiman Shabal. Wipe Party gubernatorial aspirant Hassan Omar comes a distant third with 2.6%, Hezron Awiti 1.4%, and Anania Mwaboza at 1%. 27% of the locals, however, remain undecided according to the survey. Women Representative Mishimboko led the pack of six women aspirants vying for the position with a 12.6% lead, while Changamwe Member of Parliament Omar Mwini scooped the highest score for re-election of legislators in the region at 64.2%. The survey conducted on a sample of a thousand residents that represented the county's total adult population of 582,409 was spread out across all six sub-counties and 30 words. It also showed the opposition is popular in the region at 48.2% popularity, while Jubilee Party's popularity stands at 22.9%. Rose Gakufu, Channel 1 News Hour.